Welcome to the warm-up. Go-to guy, Kevin Calabro. Welcome to our world. What are we doing today? We got anything going um, on today? Nothing. No, we got no. Jess just told us we got Kirk Herb Street. Do you, want me to, do you want me to do this for you? Don't tell anybody. We already pre-taped it, but I asked about the WSU flag on game day. Are we <laughs> supposed to, not, supposed we're not supposed to, to say that? that? Jim, it's part of the magic of radio. Is it? Yeah. No. Well, anyway, we I, like I asked him about the Cougar flag on game day. I thought that was the most important question. No, 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 I like the question you asked, though, about Jake Locker and where he fits in the NFL. And Cam Newton and Ryan Mallett. To me, that was the, the meat of the interview, and you'll hear that. What time? 3.15? 3.15. 3.15. Also today, uh, the professor at four o'clock. Uh, we will talk about boy. If the playoffs began today, guess what? Cole in your stocking. Hawks not there. Hawks not there. But that's why we've got what five games left in the season, and three of them are at home. Did you mention Paul Wolf? I uh, did not mention Paul Wolf. Paul Wolf at three thirty. He'll be with us. We asked uh, Kirk Herbstreit if Mike Bellotti might be in the coaching game soon. And he specifically, even, he referenced. Pullman. Pullman. We didn't ask Paul Wolf about that. I didn't ask Paul Wolf that. about. I didn't ask Paul Wolf about Bellotti coming back into college coaching, and coming to Pullman. Obviously, that wouldn't right. be cool to ask Paul Wolf. It's about. a possibility, though. You did ask Paul Wolf though about his job and you know what he thought about it. And so well, that's, that's what I will ask him. Yeah. We didn't tape that. That's anymore. right. That's on at three thirty, that, or will be on at three thirty. Also, we're still waiting for Dan Monson to call us. He promised he would call. We're still waiting for the former Zags coach, 1999 Elite Eight, at the world at his feet. I didn't know that the University of Washington was that close to hiring him, and he took the Minnesota job instead. Well, from reading Percy Allen's story, it sounded like he accepted the Washington job, then changed his mind. I think, was he at Minnesota at the time? I, uh, I thought he was leaving Gonzaga. We better get cleared up on that story. Yeah. Jeez, it wouldn't be like us to be wrong about something. Well, I kind of just brushed over the story. You know that ancient history stuff. They got Romar now. He's won over 170 some games. He's doing a nice job. Yeah, Final Four team there. The UW. Well, I don't know about that. I'm not quite sold on him. We'll see. They got Long Beach State tonight. We'll touch base uh, with Washington basketball in some shape or form and talk about Long Beach State and uh, Dan Monson coaching that club tonight at the UW. Does that do it for us? I think so. That wasn't a very good. One. Been the warm up. That was all right. <laughs> over a hundred hits. It's a new record. 